I want you to see if you can kind of expand on this because I thought it was very interesting when I heard you say it. And you said uh, something to the effect that uh, thinking is the process of linking things together. And my brain just went into like, like, like all the connections of, of, and I guess maybe even I thought of my brain doing all those neurological connections and like, I just envisioned that and kind of like, so I don't know, can you kind of like how, what, what you meant by that? Yeah. I mean, I think, I think kind of just what you, what you just said that, that the act of thinking is the act of making connections. And often the way we're taught in schools is sort of opposed to thinking. Because what they want you to do is it, it, it's kind of like a um, hierarchy, right? So you're when you're in your English class, you, you, just, you just do English, right? And when you go to your history class, it's history, right? And you're supposed to learn all the facts and you're supposed to just be able to play them back. You don't make connections from, you know, I, you know, I remember when I was writing my, my dissertation and all of a sudden I, I had this image of a book is a, uh, an, a calcul- an equation in calculus, a differential equation in calculus, right? Because it's, it's infinite, right? But it's particular. And I, all of a sudden, and we don't have to get into that, but I, I saw this great connection between calculus and what I was working on. And then, you know, uh, the role of the stomach. Nietzsche talks a lot about the stomach and the body. Um, and Deleuze and Guattari too, they, it's, you know, and they move between all kinds of worlds. All oh, they, they'll talk about birds and music and um, art and you know concepts, philosophical concepts, and then their own experience and different foods. And they they're constantly moving between all these things to make these kind of connections, not to unify them, not to say this and this and this are equal to each other. That's not what I'm saying at all. And that's often what. The, what I'm saying gets translated as, right? It's like, well, let's find what's common between history and physics and calculus and the body. But I'm saying, no, 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 no. It's about making weird little worlds, right? And and saying, oh yeah, I see this and I can plug this thing into it. And, you know, uh, the way, um, the way, you know, in, in this chapter in this book of Deleuze and Guattari, they talk about bird songs and they talk about, and they, they're talking about a little boy leaving his house humming and how he hums his song is how he sort of builds his ground like we were talking about it makes his kind of ground for him so he feels safe when he's out of school and he, and how it repeats and then they start talking about birds and how birds will occupy space through songs right and then they start talking about marching bands that don't do that right a marching band like a military band is about just banging the same thing and keeping everybody in line and then, so they're talking about the military and they're talking about different kinds of rhythms and music. And they're talking about birds and they're talking about how human beings find peace in the world. And then they talk about a, how Freud, a psychologist, read the little boy singing to himself. They're making connections. It's not all one thing, but they share a kind of, reading that chapter in the book, let me see the world differently. Their thoughts became a kind of um, lens in which I could suddenly see the world. And, I, and birds weren't just this other thing like animals, but they were intimately connected. The song of the bird I wake up to is connected to how I feel when, I lead, when I'm walking down the hall humming to myself, right? That these worlds are all connected and it's the thinking, the th- their thought let me see the world differently because they made these different connections between things. So the, 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 the connections they were making, these different, uh, connections, you try to, you, you, uh, it allows you to travel in the space within, right. Or between, right. And between all that, all that stuff. Right. I mean, that's where you're trying to travel and you can get, you can get to those points or connections they're making, but you don't have to, you can still just travel around them. Right. It's, it's good. That's beautiful. Oh my God. I love that. I'm going to borrow you, borrow that from you. I'll give you credit. Um, but yeah, it's the movement. It's not coming up with the answer. Like, I think we sometimes think thinking is coming up with the answer. And sometimes we need an answer, you know, it depends on the situation, right? But the act of thinking is not seeking the answer. It's the very act of in-between, moving in-between things. Bye-bye.